it's going to be more about the people. So television for the people, by the people, and I'm really interested to see how that's going to develop. As a first time attendee at TVOT, the first impression is that it's pretty cool how people are kind of really interested on the ev evolution of media, figuring out that how storytelling and technology come together, and there's something just sort of electric about that. People should attend this show if they want to understand the broader scope of the business versus their own little worlds. The audience and the panelists and the topics, I think they're very uh, timely and even slightly ahead of their time. It's the most concise way to find what is happening with the industry, where is it going, and maybe getting a few steps ahead of the game. Things like Periscope, things like virtual reality, where we're starting to push on the edge of how video will transform in the future. The latest trends on use of social tools, um, Twitter, Facebook, etc., to enhance the TV experience. Every panel, every conversation you have out here really gives you new insights and you take that back and, and helps you to develop new strategy or develop new APIs or even enhance the platform. Two years ago we were nobodies, we didn't have anything and they talked to us like anybody else. Now you know, now with product shipping, it's great, they're still talking to us. You know, I was just on a panel and we have a startup with I think like four people and a very senior guy from Fox. This isn't too technical and too deep and too geeky, it's just enough that a business person can really use this information to be smarter in the room. And I think the most interesting thing is that people stay here, so you have the time to talk to them. And for some of my clients in this world, this is an opportunity to get to them in an environment that they simply can't do when they're back at the office. I'm really impressed at the audience that is very senior and clearly understands the subject matter. It is technology and creativity and content and distribution all in one place. It's the only show of the year that is actually, that has that makeup. And that's part of why you see people coming back year after year because they have the opportunity to learn, they have the opportunity to interact, they have the opportunity to network, and it, a lot of times it plugs you into conversations that you might otherwise not been a part of. And so I think it's sort of one of those strategic imperatives right now to have this tucked under your wing and to come to this show twice a year so that you understand what's going on.